next time he has. So this brings us to Anthony Weiner. And the thing that I don't understand about I, I'm beginning to gr I'm growing convinced that somebody's really making a fatal mistake when they pass out the orientation pack for the new members of Congress. I mean, they must be like burying the lead, you know. The, the, here's here's the password to the parking garage, and the servers are rebooted at 2 a.m. Keep your pants on. I, it, it, I, I, I just don't understand. So I wrote this song about someone else <coughs> who was sar equally sartorially challenged. He invited me onto his yacht and offered me champagne and truffles platinum bowl. Would you believe I started with nothing but the clothes on my back? And in no interest loan from the governor's son. Well, there was this company down in Texas. I don't know what they do, but they seem to do it very well. I doubled my money and I watched it accrue. I tripled my money and you can too. I took three parts hubris and no parts shame. Mixed a gallon of repellent, got bitten all the same. You've been oh so entertaining, and I haven't spent a dime yet. It was dumb, but it seemed like a good idea at the time. She was a persistent little brat, and there were days I could swear that she wouldn't take no for an answer. So there was the time in the hallway and the time under my desk and the time she left to stain. And now the world will remember me as a perpetual liar who can't keep his pants zipped. And I lost my job and the dog died. And I'm staring at the tatters of my legacy and my wife has made her choice between Strom Thurmond and me. I took three parts hubris, no parts shame. Mixed a gallon of repellent and got bitten all the same. You've been oh so entertaining, and I haven't spent a dime yet. Yeah, it was dumb, yet it seemed like a good idea at the time. Those pesky small corrections that leap in from all directions are just pebbles in the path, they'll never crease your placid brow. But from the poles to the equator, they're gonna look real stupid later. And if you ask my frank opinion, you don't look too clever now. So if you've ever left a courthouse with a bag over your head and referred all reporters to your attorney, if you've ever stopped reading the paper because every time you read the paper thinking things couldn't get any worse, they get worse. And if your ears are ringing with the sound of mocking laughter, and your face is flushed and your nerves are shot, you might pray for something curable like the plague or halitosis, but that ain't gonna be your doctor's diagnosis. You went heavy on the hubris and skimmed on the shame Mixed a gallon of repellent, got bitten all the same. You've been oh so entertaining, and I haven't spent a dime. Yeah, it was dumb, but it seemed like a good idea at the time. Yes, it seemed like a good idea at the time. Thank you.